A few years ago, I made a video about the fact that the moon rotates around the Earth, and that's why we only see one face of the moon. Now, I keep getting comments of people still get very confused about this. I've noticed this week that it's been picked up by a flat Earth YouTube channel, um, and they've been talking through the video, and they still misunderstand what the video is and what it's showing. Um, so I'm going to make another video now, which kind of has a, an updated version of the animation, which will show you what it does, how it works, um, what it's supposed to be showing. So here's my updated video just to help explain what I'm talking about when I say that the moon is rotating while going around the earth and that's why we see one face. It all makes sense when I show the video. Let's go take a look. So I've got two versions of the animation on this timeline here. One is going to be rotating and one is static. So when I play the animation as it is at the moment, you'll see that one is spinning and one is stationary. That's important when I do the animation again in a minute when I make these move because the spinning one will stay spinning and the static one will stay static as they move around in a circle. So I've added a guide path now. These are going to move in a circle, but they are not at the moment spinning. Neither of these are spinning. So as they move in the circle, they're orientated in the same position in space all the time. If you're in between those, you would see all the different faces as it travels around. So now I'll play the animation. Remember, the one on the left is now spinning. The one on the right isn't spinning at all. It's just the, the graphic going around. As you can see, the one that is spinning, while it's going in a circle, will now show the same face to the centre of that orbit all the time. If you were on the Earth in the middle of that, you'd see the same face of the Moon all the time. The one that isn't spinning, coming at the bottom of the screen now, that's not spinning, that's always pointing to the same position in space. If you was in the centre of that, you would see all the different faces of the moon over the course of a month. It's the combination of the fact that it is spinning while it's going around in a circle at exactly the same rate that means we see one face of the moon. I'll play it again big as you can see, and I'll put the Earth in the middle as well. Remember, one of these is rotating and the other one is not rotating. And you can see the difference between the two is how they appear from when you'd be looking at it from Earth, looking out at the Moon. Which one you'd see one face of and which one you would see all the faces. Hope that helps. As always, more comments please. Let me know what you think and if you need more questions answered about this, I'll happy to explain it. Thanks again for your time. Cheers. Goodbye.